Sandy Stimson is now in his fourth year as mayor of Mobile. What kind of job is he doing? Tonight, Mobile citizens grade the mayor in an exclusive News 5 strategy research poll. We're excited about Carnival. Sandy Stimson cut the ribbon yesterday as the cruise ship industry returned to Mobile, one of his top accomplishments in his three years in office. I really think it's that people are seeing a whole lot of things going on in Mobile. In fact, Stimson is more popular than ever. In an exclusive News 5 strategy poll, 39% of Mobile voters gave the mayor an A for the job he's doing, 24% a B, 21% a C, and just 8% a D and an F. Whenever you've um, been, I guess, graded and it looks up, that's uh, always gratifying. So I'm, I'm appreciative of that. Stimson's overall grade point average from the voters, 2.78, up considerably from when we polled last year, and also up from his grade after one year in office. John Gray of Strategy Research conducted the poll. He's done a good job according to the city numbers all of the three years that we've surveyed. People have been pleased with the leadership they've seen in the city. Stimson remains extremely popular among white voters with 55 percent giving him an A. Overall, white voters give the mayor a 3.21 grade point average, almost a B plus. All lives have value. And despite some racially tense moments this year, after a black teen suspect was shot and killed by a white police officer, Stimson's popularity with black voters is higher than ever. 45% of black voters give him an A or a B, compared to just 25% who give him a D or an F. His overall 2.29 GPA from black voters, a C plus, is higher than the mayor polled after his second year in office or after his first. And Stimson says he remains dedicated to his campaign slogan of One Mobile. I think that what we have been uh, exhibited by through our actions is that we mean that. It's not just lip service trying to appease people, but also that we're listening. And we're trying to do things, incorporate ideas uh, of things that need to be done to make the disenfranchised feel like that they are just as important as anybody else. Stimson has announced he'll seek a second term in office. The election is next August. You know, I think every uh, elected official hopes that nobody runs against them, but that's, that's kind of pipe dreaming. But so far, he's unopposed. I think to run and win against Sandy Stimson, I think it would be very hard to do right now. But Gray warns no one is ever unbeatable. Everything's about the comparison. Right? You might be a great candidate for office until I put up someone better than you. Our poll was conducted by phone late last month. Tomorrow, we'll see how voters grade the city council.